everybody. We've been having bedtime devotions as I read through good night devotions. This is really nice because we take one short little verse and then we read a story to know how to apply it to our life. So it's really important to get into the habit of spending time alone with God and devotion is just setting a few minutes aside each day to learn about God and to love on God and let him know that he's so important to us. So let's continue with our devotions. This one is called A Wrong Wish, and the verse that we're learning about today is God said, I will help you. And it's from the book of Isaiah, chapter 41, verse 10. Can you say it with me? God said, I will help you, Isaiah 41, 10. Sophie Springley liked everything about Mia Chang. Sophie liked Mia's shiny black hair, her striped swing set, and her pet parrot, Kiki. But best of all, Sophie liked Mia's new bracelet. It's from China, said Mia. Sophie wished more than anything to have that bracelet. One day, Sophie saw something sparkly in her yard. It was Mia's bracelet. It must have fallen off when she and Sophie were playing the other day. How it sparkled. Sophie ran to her room to try it on. Sophie thought that the bracelet was the prettiest one in the world. It wouldn't hurt if I keep it a little longer, she thought. After school the next day, Mia called across the yard to Sophie. Sophie quickly ducked into the house. Why didn't she want to see Mia? Weren't they friends? Sophie felt funny inside. She decided to put the bracelet on again. That would make her feel better, wouldn't it? But it didn't. The bracelet didn't seem so sparkly now. The pretty beads didn't make Sophie happy anymore. Now Sophie didn't wish for a bracelet. She wished she knew what to do. Could God help Sophie? She prayed and thought about what God would want her to do. Then Sophie ran to Mia's house. My bracelet, said Mia when she saw what was in Sophie's hand. I thought it was lost, Mia said and slipped the sparkly bracelet on her wrist. Sophie smiled. It's such a pretty bracelet, Mia, when you wear it. Come on, let's play on your swing set. All right, Nightlight is wondering, why did Sophie hide from Mia? Any ideas? Do you remember from the story? Well, how did God help Sophie? Wishing or wanting to have something that belongs to someone else isn't good. Sometimes it's hard not to want something our friends have. God can help us to not be jealous and to want good things that will help others instead of hurting them. Remember, ask God for help. Let's pray. Dear God, please help me to see what's good and right and to do what's best in your sight. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, here's a sleepy time activity. God can help you want good things for others. Think of some people and then you can pray for good things for them. You could pray for joy for your mommy or pray for love for your brother. But Nightlight wishes you a peaceful night for you. Good night. Well, that's a good story. You know, you might want something that your friend has, but I bet there's a friend that wants something that you have. So it's best to just be happy for each other because good things come to us at different times and when you're happy for your friend when they do something good or they have something really exciting they're going to be happy for you when it's your turn to have good things happen to you i love you guys keep doing good things for god bye for now